Tomorrow, the Alta City Council needs to talk about, among other things, bringing a new ambulance service to the city and the county, plus updates on several ongoing projects tonight and Monday with the mayor. And so here we are again. It's good to see you. It's been a while. It has been. Oh, wow. Severe weather's played a part in me not being here, right? Oh, yes, and so. there definitely in your area has been really crazy mm -hmm. uh, and stuff. So you all had flooding even yesterday, oh, right? Flooding, yeah, it was, it was flooded pretty bad yesterday. Uh, there were a couple roads that were just completely covered in water and just, um, but you know, we're blessed to have rain. That's the thing. We're, mm -hmm. we're blessed to have rain. Other things we don't really want, but the rain <laughs> we really want, so. Well, the neighboring town of Duke suffered extensive damage as a result of a tornado mm -hmm. a couple of weeks ago. Uh, how was Altus affected by that? Well, you know, we kind of scared, it kind of hit about halfway between Altus and and uh, Duke. And we, um, uh, as I was telling you earlier, a young mm -hmm. lady that works with us that you interviewed her actually, or she lost her house at that. Mm -hmm. um, and so, uh, you know, I went out thinking nothing had bad had happened. And I looked at my siding of my house and it looks like someone has just taken a hammer to it, oh you know, and knocked a bunch of holes in it. So the city of Altus got, you know, damaged here. We lost some electricity for a while, but we have some great guys at the city that got the power going pretty quick after about two hours. So, uh, you know, count ourselves lucky that it didn't bear down on Altus, mm -hmm. but also you feel you feel for the people who lost that little in that little strip sure. there, right there. So. Wow. Well, now let's talk about some recent changes to mm -hmm. the leadership there in uh, in Altus. You have a new city attorney. Yep, uh, Cole McMahon. Uh, is, is our new city attorney. Mm -hmm. He was actually just elected to our, our, our city council. And uh, when that position came available, Cole offered to step into that, uh, and which was great, but he was really, really good as a city councilman. Mm -hmm. We're gonna hate losing him there. Mm -hmm. uh, so we've had to now uh, open that position up. We're gonna have to have a special election. When's that it. election going to be? Uh, it's probably gonna be in the, I'm, I'm thinking four months. Mm, or, okay. So it's gonna be pr probably during the presidential election if I'm guessing, so. Okay, now your city council is going to consider action to bring a new ambulance service mm -hmm. into the city and the county. Yes, well, the, we've always had a, we've always had an ambulance service, but it's been run by the county. It was going through some, some problems. Uh, the city took it over. Uh, and actually made it part of our fire department. And so our fire department is now fire department EMS. Okay. Um, and so what we're doing in tomorrow's meeting is just kind of wrapping it up so everybody knows we're gonna have this ambulance service mm -hmm. uh, and get a new ambulance for it and some other things that we need and, 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 and look at you know keeping the employees and making sure everybody feels good about what we're doing. Mm -hmm. And then the city of Altus will basically be running the EMS for the entire county. Okay. Uh, that way we have an amb one ambulance service for the entire county. Okay, so now let's move over quickly to the Reservoir Project. It's a topic we've discussed, wow, for a while. Forever, yes. How close is it to being done? It, it, you know, I drove by it yesterday, and I, it, it's pretty full. They're mm -hmm. filling it up. Uh, it looks like it's going to be a... Um, it's going to be ready for the Spirit Festival, so we can have everything out there. Fantastic! Uh, and so it's it's really coming along. And like like we said in July, mid July, we're going to have a big uh, uh, jet ski races there that are coming. Oh. I mean, so it's going to be a cool thing. So, it's, okay. But it's 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 ready to go. It looks like it. At the Spirit Festival. Let's talk about that. Mm -hmm. Spirit Festival's coming. It's it's going to be uh, in in late June. Uh huh. Um, concerts, lots of things for kids to do. They, they're still making a lot of plans. Michael Shiva, the director of our Parks and Rec, has really got, a, got it going. Uh, he put out a deal today that says all the things are happening and set right. the date. So we're, we're looking forward to it. It's a big, fun event. Fantastic. So, well, thanks for coming. It's good no, to see you it's again. It's great to be here, yeah. <laughs> okay, then. We'll be right back.